Medvedev calls on Russians not to panic over Kherson. He hopes to capture it again. Here's a summary of the article. By clicking, accept all, you agree that Yahoo and our partners will process your personal information, and use technology such as cookies, to display personalized ads and content, for ad and content measurement, audience insights, and product development. You can change your choices at any time by visiting your privacy controls. This post received a score of 5,700, with an upvote ratio of 96%. Here are the top comments in response to this article. They went from, Kherson will be Russian forever, to, hopefully we can capture it again, in a matter of weeks LMAO. There's no shot they try in a couple of weeks, fortunately. They're going to have to wait for winter to end, and they'll be facing a much stiffer resistance from Ukraine who will be much more dug in the second time around. This is actually a catastrophic loss for Russia. They won't do it at all. They basically blown up all bridges. Ha <laughs> ha. Remember when Russia could invade a country like Ukraine across 1,000 kilometers of front and attack on multiple axes? Russia will never see those days, ever again. Okay, let's hope so. But those of us old enough to remember Russia's humiliation in the First Chechen War and their utter brutality in the Second Chechen War, aren't celebrating yet. The equipment Russia has lost in Ukraine is the real issue. The Chechen War was brutal but mainly took infantry. Russia is losing their tanks, APVs, and most critically their anti-air units in massive numbers. It took over half a century to build up the amount of weaponry they've lost. Also the equipment they're largely relying on seems to be a combo of old Soviet-era gear and modernized stuff which is reliant on imported components. With trade restrictions and the lack of Soviet-era manufacturing they're going to struggle replacing any of it. A not insubstantial amount of their equipment was originally made in Ukraine even like the Moskva for example. Fuck you Dmitry. Your military is a rotting corpse. The corruption of your class killed it. Don't listen to this man Dmitry. You deserve to skim as much as you need to from the budget. The troops will make do. They are strong Russians who will take back Kherson with their bare hands. You need to treat yourself. Nothing lasts forever. Dmitry, don't you deserve another yacht? And a helicopter to land on it. Yes, you need a yacht to land on your helicopter. Then you need a boat to land on the yacht that landed on your helicopter that landed on your yacht. You know how much you always wanted one of those. Drug boat drug. What he means by, capture it again, means they're just going to try to level Kherson with bombs out of spite. Fucking dickheads. Slava Ukraini. Yep, but it isn't Mariupol. They'll never cross the Dnipro River again. It's too good of a natural defense, and they're not in a position to make successful offensives anywhere anymore. Which means it will just be spiteful killing of civilians and destruction of a city, because they can. Fuck them. This video was automatically created by Reddit to speech. The article and comments in this video were selected from Reddit according to their upvotes, and any paraphrasing was performed by smmry.com, without any human intervention.